Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Tony here. Today, we're going to be talking about how much it would cost to pull every single card of Celebrations. Or if you just wanted to go buy off TCG or eBay. Uh, it, this is just based off my experience. So you can take uh, whatever information you want from it and decide on your own which way you want to go with it. But anyways, let's just jump right into it. This is what I have for you guys. If you went out and bought every single box of celebrations just to get every single promo cards. I added the mini tins in there because I like the value of them. Uh, you get about 16 celebration packs for 135, which is which is pretty good. And another eight TCG packs. Uh, if you bought every single pack, every single box, every single collection, you're looking at about five hundred and sixty dollars. I didn't I didn't add any of the uh, Lance's Charizards or Dark Sylveon tins in there. Just because I believe the collection boxes are just better value. Also, you get the jumbo card included in both of those. So in my mind, they're just way better value. If you went and bought, so you get about sixty uh, celebration packs. If you opened up every single one, you're most likely not going to be getting a, a full complete set of uh, celebrations. If you got if you got really lucky and pulled one out of every two packs. And not got any doubles, you, you you'd be one of the luckiest people. But in the end, I don't know. You'd probably be looking at spending more like a thousand, probably a thousand to twelve hundred bucks more, like I did. I spent about twelve hundred dollars, opened up about one hundred and twenty packs, I would say, and I still didn't end up pulling my gold new. I had to go buy it on eBay, but that's not too bad. I'm I'm happy with my outcome. Uh, in the end, I didn't pull my Charizard till my hundred third pack. So obviously, it seems like a Charizard is hard card to pull. Uh, like again, this is based on my experience. Out of 100 packs, you might be able to pull one. You might be able to pull three. You might pull none. It's all depending on uh, on the luck of the cards, you know. But if you wanted to go to TCG here, you could buy the whole, your, all the 25 complete classic cards. Uh, your classic cards for uh, about 325. This is not including the Mewtwo EX, just because there wasn't one available. So you're probably looking around an average of 325. You may be able to get a little cheaper depending how how good you look. These are all near mint cards. Try to stick with the same seller, uh, but that's about an average price. If you wanted to get a complete master set, about 50 to 50, you're probably looking at about 425. That's because of your gold new. You're spending about 60 to 70 dollars on that. Could be even more depending on the prices on TCG at the time. Also, you if you wanted to get all the promos, you're probably looking at around five hundred dollars. Okay, that's that's if you wanted to get every single promo from TCG. Um, these are all near mint cards. You're obviously not sure exactly what you're getting. You're probably getting like PSA eights, nines. Uh, you're most likely not getting any PSA tens. That's just just how it works when you're buying raw cards. But in the end, if you go to um, eBay. You could be finding listings for, you know, 500 is a near, near complete, probably missing your Charizard for 400. Obviously these comes, most of these come with your, your, your jumbo cards, 15 promo cards, 600. So you'd be probably paying around five, 600 bucks on eBay, depending where you are, depending on your shipping. Obviously it's a little more. Somebody wants 1100 bucks, but it's probably not going to get. But yeah, it's obviously a little more on uh, on eBay because they got to pay their fees. But you're probably looking at anywhere from five, six hundred bucks. So it's depending on what you want to do and how you want to collect. If you want to just go out and buy your set, buy it from TCG, buy it from eBay, or if you wanted to go out and and buy your boxes, it's 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 all up to you. But in the end, it, it, I'd say the smartest choice would be going on eBay or going to your uh, like a um, local uh, marketplace just to go see because you can actually get to look at the the pictures see the cards and see the quality a little better i'm not a big fan of tcg just because it's it's more uh, american it's i don't find i don't buy too much off it but anyways if this helped you in any ways please uh give this video a like thanks for watching and again happy collecting peace out